We finna get on the highway, and I'm finna show y'all the centers of PO 500. So as y'all see, man, it's shifting now just fine, but look at the speedometer, bro. What's good to you, my man? It's your boy Topic, you know, back with another video. So if you guys new to the channel, man, I need y'all to like, comment, subscribe, man, share the video, man, because your boy on the road to 1K, bro. So today, we're going to be discussing code P0500 on the Mercury Grand Marquis. Uh, if your Mercury Grand Marquis have a 4R70 or 4R75W automatic transmission, this video is especially for you. A vehicle speed sensor measures transmission output or wheel speed, sends information to ECM, which helps modify engine's functions such as ignition timing, air and fuel ratio, transmission shift points, the diagnostic for the ECM. It says output, so this is the output shaft speed sensor, guys. Y'all just paused it. That's the part number. So now, for the input vehicle speed sensor, guys, this sensor comes out of the store like this. This is how you have to install it, guys. So when you take your original vehicle speed sensor out, man, this is all you really got to do. This little C clamp right there come off. When you put it on your new part. Um, I'm going to post a picture somewhere in this video the exact locations of the vehicle speed sense taking my time on this video because i don't want to tell y'all no false information and i'm hoping that this fix my issue today but if it don't guys we still gonna post the video some guys so we gonna go and get on the car and i'm gonna show y'all the exact locations and the exact parts i'm gonna be changing today guy right, anytime you working on a sensor or something you want to take the battery post out guy so the um uh, computer can reset itself Boom, all right, so we finna go in the car, guys. I already have two transmission vehicle sensors right here. These are the inputs. I done changed this part three times, but I never changed the um, output shaft sensor, so. Yeah, guys, we gonna get into it. You say, right tight, left and loose. This can work sometime, guys. Let go to screw. 12 millimeter. And this sensor comes out fairly easy, guys. You know what I'm saying? Boom. So, I didn't put that little piece on. I'm going to put that piece on now. Here we go, um... Uh, Take this off. I already had the piece off earlier, so. Same. Put that to the side. Get the new one. You gotta put the uh, clamps in there. Boom. Hope y'all can see that real good. Yes, yeah, sir. This the new one, like I told y'all earlier. You wiggle it enough it to go back in and scrape. 12 millimeter bolt. Make sure there's no type of damage done to your harness, man. Make sure you observe that harness, guys. Boom. If I can get y'all a nicer view, man. There we go. Right there. That's the output shaft speed sensor. This exact part right here, guys. So this is what we finna go in with next. Guys, I'm just showing y'all where it's at. Since I can't get the angle for you guys, I'm just gonna change and I'll be right back with y'all. So chill my, we got the horn is off. As y'all see, man, it's right there. Well and behold. So we 
We finna go and take this bad boy out with this eight millimeter. See, let's see. So y'all had to fight with him. I'ma uh, be back right back with y'all guys. As y'all see, there we go. Let me turn y'all up right so y'all can see it better. So bam, it's literally man a foot in front of this one. So you go straight down. You see? That's the tail. You know the sense? Go straight down. We right here. Real close. Literally. I had to get a um, little flathead screwdriver and pry on the gray part just to get it started. Sorry y'all could see it, but it popped in. I wish I had a lift. But man, if the channel grow, man, I promise y'all guys, man, me and my brother's gonna get a shot. So chill my, we got both sensors installed. Input, put the um the little cap back on top of it, and we have the output sensor right here. Yes, sir. So we gonna crank up, take around the block, see what she do, guys. Let's let's hope for the best, guys. This red light, right? We're gonna see if we can get in third gear before we get to the next light. The next light is right there. So let's see when the light turns green. y'all see man speedometer working the cruise control work man that thing it, it, it's shifting out right and all it saying got the little music in the junk so uh yeah guys and um y'all just stay tuned <laughs>